hello friends i have a very quick little video for you guys today so a shoe company reached out to me and asked if they could send me some shoes for me to do a review of them and if you can't tell from behind me i have quite the shoe collection i really love shoes and so of course i was like yeah absolutely why not and as soon as i went to their website i was so excited because their shoes are so cute so the shoes they sent me are these adorable little square toed mary jane style little kitten heels i love these so much i think the square toe is so cute it's very unique and the band that goes across your foot right here for one is like a stretchy material which makes it nice because it'll form to your foot and they already had it tied in one spot and i tied it even a little bit tighter it's nice you can just do a simple knot and it will stay that way it fits my feet well i was a little bit nervous because they are square toed that they might be too wide on me but they actually fit perfectly and i just love that you can actually adjust that right there because i do have pretty slim feet the shoes themselves are very comfortable they're pretty flexible and form to your feet well i honestly did need a little pair of heels because i'm testing out a few different ones to wear to my best friend's wedding so these are definitely a strong contender i feel like they're dressy enough but not too over the top they're definitely not something that i won't be able to walk in because i cannot walk in heels let me tell you guys but <laughs> the inside sole is very cushiony and comfortable i feel like i could walk around in these all day and be fine which is very rare for a heel and they did even send me little insoles as well that i could put in for added comfort which i thought was really nice the packaging they came in was very nice they were wrapped up really well they even threw in a little rose which i thought was so precious i absolutely love these i highly recommend if you would like to check them out i do have a discount code for you guys just click the link down in my description and I will throw the code up on the screen for you because that's usually a little bit easier. I believe this brand Empress is Australian and their sizing is not in US sizing. So these that I got are a 36 or a US 5. Just make sure you check their conversion charts that they have. But I will say these are definitely a true size 5. That is the only size that I wear. I wear the smallest size in adults and they fit me great. I was very pleasantly surprised because sometimes sizing is a little bit different depending on the brand and everything so I'm glad that those fit and I didn't want to just sit down and only do a review because I feel like I just didn't want this video to be too short or too boring for you guys so I am going to go ahead and style these for you guys today as well. I'm going to show you three different looks for them. I'm going to dress them up a little bit, do some more casual looks because Although I got these as a strong contender for wearing to my best friend's wedding, I absolutely will be wearing these other than that. I can see them styled in so many different ways, both casually and more dressed up. So I'm just really happy to finally have a pair of heels, but they're not like heels. You know what I mean? I love a piece that's a little more versatile. That way I can pair it many different ways in my closet. Without further ado, let's go ahead and style these bad boys up. I'm so excited. For this first outfit, I wanted to go for something a little more on the casual side. I felt like just the simple black and white was such a cute look. Let me back up so you guys can actually see the shoes. Like, look how freaking cute these are. I'll show some good close-ups of the shoes too, but I just really like how this looks. I think that even though it's a very basic and simple outfit, it definitely is a little more elevated because of the shoes. I think it looks a little classy, but not like super dressed up. To take this look a little more on the casual side, I wanted to throw some really cute socks on with these actually. And I did want to say just off the bat, these are so freaking comfortable. I love how easy they are to just slip on and off. They are made out of leather, but it's a very soft and flexible leather, I will say. Uh, these look so cute with these little socks. Are you kidding me? I had to go with a very frilly little ruffle sock. This is very much reminding me of when I did ballet. I used to always wear these little ruffle socks when I was a kid. Look how cute! Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. This right here is exactly how I think I would wear them on a more day-to-day -day casual basis, just because I personally prefer to wear socks 
no matter what shoes I'm wearing. And I love that these look good either way. So here's my second look. This one's even more casual than the last one. I did keep the cute little frilly socks on, but I swapped out for a black maxi, like mini maxi skirt. It's one of the tiered ones. So it's really flowy and comfortable. And then I've been loving the more oversized on oversized look lately. So I just threw on one of my favorite oversized sweaters. This really plays into the casual look because it is so baggy, but then it just brings in that hint of feminine with the shoes, which I think is perfect because I like to kind of mix things up like that. You know, sometimes I go for like a foldy masculine look, sometimes I like a little mix of masculine and feminine, or sometimes I like to just go fully feminine. Something else I love is since the heel is not super high, they are genuinely the most comfortable heels I've ever worn. And they only have the original insoles in them. I haven't even tried the other ones that they sent me. So I could literally walk around these all day. I could go take a walk in the park. I could go to the farmer's market, which reminds me, let me grab something to dress this look up a little bit more. Now that the weather is getting warmer, I've been loving wearing my fanny pack as like a good crossbody bag. And that brings in the black in this outfit even more. So this was exactly what I would wear to go to like a farmer's market or something if it was just like slightly chilly. So let's try one more outfit. I'm gonna try to dress these up a little bit more. Okay, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I am a proud outfit repeater. I love this combo so much of my silk blouse with these trousers, but I have never in my life paired heels with trousers. I feel like such a fancy little businesswoman. If I worked an office job, I would absolutely wear this. It is so comfortable and the silk blouse is super soft and I love trousers like this, especially when they have elastic in the waistband because they're very comfortable and like the nice wide kind of straight leg of them is so comfortable. These are literally like, it feels like I'm wearing pajamas, but I look so fancy. And then pair it with these heels that are as comfortable as sneakers. You just can't go wrong. And I did take the socks off so that they looked a little bit more mature. I love this outfit so much. I feel so confident and powerful. <laughs> like, who am I? I absolutely love these. I can't get over how comfortable they are. I think that's definitely the key factor for me because I have major sensory issues and these are not bothering me literally in the slightest. So the only thing I will say is that they sound like heels, but they are heels. So like, you know, I'm not going to deduct any points for that. That's just a very personal thing that I don't love the clicking of heels. It could also be a lot more obnoxious, I will say. I find some other shoes that I'm like, I can't even wear these. I could definitely get over it. I just sound powerful is all. I sound like a principal walking down the halls. I'm gonna try to do one more look for you guys just because I feel like the first two were a little too similar. So let's just do one little bonus look, okay? I'm feeling very good about this bonus outfit. I paired this very cute little sweater vest, which if you watched my closet swap out, you saw that I completely forgot I had this and I've just been so excited to wear it. So I paired it with these black cutoff shorts and then I did some little ruffle socks this time instead of the really, really frilly ones. These are just a nice like ribbed material and they just have the lettuce stem right at the top. So they're not like, super over the top, but I think they look really cute. I just wanted to bring in a little bit of lightness to match with my sweater vest. And then, you know, the black matches the black. So I think this outfit came together very, very cute. I was a little nervous to pair these with shorts or pants because I just always equate heels with dresses, but this totally proved me wrong. I can genuinely see myself wearing these all summer long because they do look good with any freaking outfit it's kind of blowing my mind right now <laughs> to be completely honest with you because this was like my wild card i was just like i'm just gonna pair it with shorts and just see and it still looks freaking cute so that was all for my little review for empress shoes i genuinely do recommend them 
I think that they're amazing quality, they're super super comfortable, and they're easy to slide on and off. They look good with everything. Like I said, literally the only downside of them, at least these specifically, is that they do click clack a little bit because they are heels, which, you know, is to be expected. That's just a very personal preference. And then they are a little more on the expensive side. I do think it's worth the investment. I do have a discount code for you guys, and they're going to give you $10 off of your order. I saw whenever I was filming this video that they are on sale too, so hopefully that will take even more money off for you guys because they do retail right at $150 and I understand not everybody is willing to invest that much in a pair of shoes, but like I said, I think quality and comfort wise, it's definitely worth it. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. This was just a little sprinkle into some styling videos that are coming very soon. I plan on doing a whole spring outfits video for you guys. So this definitely helped spark some inspiration for that. If you wanna see more videos from me, make sure you subscribe and go ahead and check out Empress Shoes. I'll have them linked down below. They do have a few different styles and a few different colors. So if you're interested, click that link, use my discount code, but otherwise, I will see you guys in a video very, very soon. I love you guys so much. Bye.